Hey, before I get into the video, um, I want to go over another deck giveaway. Um, all you have to do in order to win this deck is go down into the description box, click on the link. It's going to take you to another website called Curious. Um, I do have a beginner course on there that I know is going to help out a lot of you guys. Um, so what I recommend doing is just sign up for the free trial and then kind of end it before the trial ends. This way you guys don't have to pay for anything. Um, and when you do that, make sure you comment done down below in the comments and I will give the deck to one lucky winner. So um, in order to do this trick, what you have to do is let's say you mixed up the deck and you had a spectator pick a card. So it can be any card. Let's say they were to pick this one. Um, in this case, I don't want to look at it, so I'm going to show you guys the card. Hopefully, you guys can see it here. And all I want to do here is you guys can say stop. Let's say you were to say stop right there. All I want to do is stick your card, put it into the middle, and leave it there. And then maybe I can cut up the deck a little bit and mix the card further into the deck. So uh, from here, I'm going to try and pick a card, and hopefully it'll be yours. I'm just going to riffle down. Hopefully I stop. Guys, look, I have no pinky breaks. I'm going to riffle down, let's say, here. And at this point, I'm going to flip over the card. And as you can see, this isn't your card. But what I'm going to do is, let's say I can take it, give it a little shake. And just like that, you can see your card has changed. So this is uh, the trick, guys. Hope you guys like it. And don't forget to stick around for the tutorial. All right, so hopefully you guys like the performance. Uh, don't forget to do the deck giveaway. Um, but anyways, this is how you're going to be able to do the trick. So, as you can see, it was pretty simple. Um, basically, all you have to do is, let's say, you give the deck to a spectator, and they can shuffle it up. Um, it's a completely random deck, so it doesn't really matter about the order. Um, and you have them pick any card that they like. So it can be a random one, and let's say in this case, they have the King of Spades. So, um, all you have to do here is, whatever method you want to do, you can put their card in the middle, control it back, to the top that is the basic idea all I did in the performance was they had their card they said stop wherever they wanted to I'm leaving it in the middle you can show it to them and then from here you're going to dribble the cards kind of not on top of the deck because obviously you want to get a pinky break but what you have to do is you dribble it kind of so where the top half of the deck as you can see here in my right hand dribbles down and it's going to land like this. So as you can see when you dribble the cards down from this point you can pick up the cards from where they're out jogged and transfer it to a thumb break and then you can cut the cards down bringing that selected card to the top. And then from here you can go through spread the deck and say look I'm gonna go through and pick this card here and this one should be your card and then you can show it to the spectator and as they're looking at it you flip it over and as you can see it's not their card while they're looking at this card that is not theirs you push over the top card pull it back catch a break and from here you say you know what uh, well considering this isn't your card and all you have to do is put it back on top of the deck and leave it flush so this way you have a pinky break here you pick it up from the break and you tilt the card if you're right-handed you tilt it kind of to the right so you have your thumb on the bottom right corner in your middle finger on the top left. So you're holding the card. This way you can grip it with your thumb, middle, and then you're gonna be using your index here to swivel the card just like that. So it's pretty simple. You shake the card and at the same time you're shaking it, you are just turning it over like that. So pretty simple. Shake it, twist it, and that's basically uh, the end of the trick. You can show it to the spectator. and. Uh,